I, I was here yesterday and I waited 40 minutes. When I got here, the lady said we're out of gas. A desperate search for gasoline continues across South Florida as drivers face empty pumps or long lines. While tankers from Port Everglades are stepping up deliveries, there are still delays. Tonight, the mayor of Miami-Dade County is urging drivers to please be considerate. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench has more from Miramar. It took me a while to find a station with plenty of gasoline, like this one on Miramar Parkway, west of I-75. I waited in line for 45 minutes and then found the pumps were working very slowly. Uber driver Brian Banks says the search for gasoline has been a huge challenge. This has been a little difficult since I'm the flooding in Port Everglades. I do it full time, so it's my livelihood right now. So, you know. I depend on it. I've been looking all over. I have to travel all the way to South Miami and I only had a quarter tank. It has been a difficult day for Ricardo Casabona. Uh, of course I'm worried. This is, this is nonsense what's going on. Casabona was finally able to get gasoline at this station on Miramar Parkway at Southwest 172nd Avenue. Maria Lori says it took her two days. I can't believe it. I mean, I, I have not. I, I was here yesterday and I waited 40 minutes. When I got here, the lady said, we're out of gas. So I had to come back today. How long have you been waiting today? At least an hour and a half. It's been pretty hard. Beatrice Ospina and her husband were worried they might run out of gasoline. Oh my goodness, it's scary. I mean, think nothing gets it's getting better. I mean, it's pretty, I don't know. Last week's flooding damaged some underground pumps at Port Everglades, but nine out of 12 terminals have recovered, up from seven on Monday. Plus, ports in Tampa and Canaveral are helping out, and authorities say tankers are stepping up deliveries. We continue to ask that people are, are you know, we know they're frustrated, but they continue to have a little bit more patience. Uh, through the next several days, we don't know uh, how long it's going to be until all the terminals come online. I will tell you that the supply is there. While this is good news, we ask that you please only purchase gas when you absolutely need it. The Miami-Dade mayor says stocking up on gasoline puts a strain on the delivery system. The Port Everglades director says the state has been able to secure a half million gallons of fuel from the state of Louisiana, and it is on its way to South Florida. In Miramar, Peter Dench, CBS News, Miami.